this is Full Game Prometheus giving you another live game uh, recap. Uh, once again, going to be rolling with the Tennessee Titans uh, playbook and be uh, focusing on um, single back, um, uh, south, uh, uh, double south, and also going to be focusing on the I form slot is my main offense. Uh, on defense, I'm going to be using the Detroit uh, uh, Lions defensive playbook, and I'll be jumping into uh, basically the um, the 43 under uh, safety blitz 3 defense is my base defense, and I'll also be jumping around in some nickel packages and nickel 3-3 uh, three, three odds. So, um, my opponent was running with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers and um, he was pretty good on offense. He, he was able to break down my defense fairly well. Uh, he was someone who actually really depended a lot on um, a no huddle to move the ball effectively. Uh, but uh, I'll share with you that uh, he basically um, was very aggressive on defense. He was using a lot of engage H uh, blitzes. I think he was doing some hybrid adjustments with his outside cornerbacks to try to bait me into some plays. Um, and sometimes he was trying to manually blitz into uh, against me. So uh, right here I'm establishing the run. And he actually gets a little strip tack, uh, strip uh, right there with the ball and gets the ball back. So uh, it would have been uh, a, a first down on the other side of the field and he actually gets a nice animation with with the CPU to go get a, get a strip and get the ball back so uh, right here he goes with um, a counter play he brings his wide receiver over but because I'm running that that safety blitz is going to bring guys down to the box to stop him for a two yard gain so second and eight type situation once again, hitting him with the, the safety uh, play right here, I do inverted cover two, just to try to give him a little look right there. My corner comes down and plays uh, his his uh, tight end, Howard. Howard is going to be a guy that actually uses. So now he jumps into the no huddle. You'll see a lot of no huddle out of this guy. Uh, and I go ahead and hit him with the sting blitz. And actually defensive back uh, makes a nice play on the outside receiver right there. And he goes for it on fourth and three. I guess uh, I guess this type of situation he's thinking um, he got a freebie with getting a ball and nothing to lose right there. So I, I tried him with a, some pressure off the edge, and his uh, quarterback overthrows the ball right there, and I think a lot of it has because I had dropped um, some uh, defensive ends and my, my defensive tackle over. So this is what he was running. He was running a lot of engage eight, uh, so it was forcing me to get rid of the ball fairly quicker right there. So I do a nice, nice little possession catch with Gabriel to go and get a first down. Um, going back, he's showing me engage eight a look again. You can see the guys come rushing in, uh, and I'm, I missed my, my wheel route right there. The wheel route should have been open um, for a completion, but my wide receiver actually pulled off on, on, on the route. I think I tried to rack it, and the animation actually pulled him out of the out of the area, so that, that kind of frustrated me right here. So now it actually goes, I think he was still with engage 8 or with cover, uh, uh, cover 2, and I'm able to go ahead and get a nice little completion with that wheel route on the back end side. So right here, um, he's showing me the, 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 the wide, uh, 43 wide. And I know this is a, a, a cover two coverage, so I jump into the lead draw to try to get him on a lead draw. But look at his uh, his uh, linebacker actually shoots the gap and takes out on my running back before I can actually get pushed up uh, up the field. So now I go into the single back double south, and uh, I'm looking um, uh, to the, the levels concept off the left hand side. Uh, right here, the corner's wide open. I'm able to go in and, and, and possession catch it. I want to make sure I possession catch it right there, get the ball down to the red zone. So uh, go into single back uh, with the quick uh, quick toss play. I've got basically a full um, scheme down in the red zone that I've got to make sure I fall into a little bit more. So right here, I go back to it again, and this is the Z spot. Nice little delayed release, and it's usually good for a good touchdown, especially if your opponent's not prepared for it. So back on defense again, I think I, I dropped down to hard flats. I'm using a single back, and um, I'm <laughs> flipping around on my views right there. I got, got myself out of that. I, I'm pretty lucky that it didn't quick hike me. I could have been in some serious trouble. So right here, um, I, I, <laughs> right here, Rokon Smith, I put him at the starting uh, linebacker position for me, and he's, he made a ton of plays for me in this particular game. So back to the D, uh, single back double south. This is a play action play. I've got Gabriel um, on a, a little release right here, and the middle of the field is wide open. Uh, Robinson's got position. Nice little possession catch come down with it right here. So um, I think I went into a draw play out of this because he, he fell back into coverage, and the draw play was the right call right there. I'm able to go ahead and pick up a good nine yards, a little broken tackle by Howard to get the ball up uh, to a nice little eight yard gainer. He's got the box stacked, so I go ahead and run, uh, go back into 
into bench. And I'm looking for the corner right here. The corner is open, but I miss throw the ball. I throw it to uh, a triple coverage position right there. Um, I actually I was looking to the corner and I just I, I hit the wrong button just the wrong wrong mechanics so I give the ball back to this guy so now he jumps into a wide set and I didn't get my my, my defense set up I gotta go and take away the crosser he actually goes to the opposite side where my defenders at probably because I picked him off a couple times and he doesn't he doesn't have confidence in it that I'm, I'm not gonna pick him off so right here it goes back to a crosser right there it's, it's kinda like a verticals concept once again no huddle again um, I went ahead and dropped into the complete zones right here and um, that's a nice little drop down right there they're crossing uh, across right over the middle no huddle again now I cross man my 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 uh, my safety is just to kind of mess up his reason it works sure enough he almost throws in the coverage right there because Amos is over over the top of that guy so once again a cross man my guys again uh, and actually tries running the ball against me That's like one of the only times he actually tries to run the ball so fourth and three situation Crossman, my guys, I actually use, I think, cloud flats or hard flats in this type of situation. He actually drops it down to uh, his, he was using smash as one of his base plays, and he, he made the progressions pretty quickly, uh, but I'm able to go ahead and get him stopped. So now I'm in the driver's seat. Two minutes and 20 seconds left right here. Uh, if I get myself, um, you know, maybe a first down, uh, work the clock a little bit. So no, see, look at that. He actually took a timeout right there. So the guy understands the concept of the game. So right here, I'm taking a look at Robinson off the left hand side side. Do you see how that, that defensive back actually squats down in that route? Um, I didn't look at the check and release and that messed me up and he actually, because he's using engage 8, uh, he gets really good aggressive pressure against me. So now I go into another play right here and the guys are just killing my offensive line. I should have blocked six, uh, but that wasn't a thing. So I go ahead and pump the ball back off to him. No reason to go ahead and give this guy um, a short field at all. There's uh, um, in this type of situation, he hasn't really shown me anything on uh, on offense. Uh, he tries to hit me with a wheel route. Uh, defensive back is there to make a play. I'm trying to hit him with the crossman blitz, and I'm not getting this set up. And uh, he was quick hiking a lot, uh, so that actually caught me off guard. Right here is a little hitch route. Good play right there. Actually gets a nice completion. Goes into uh, a no huddle situation again. I, I quickly switch in man coverage just to try to mess up his reads, and he throws to the right receiver, which is his running back, which is the guy I was actually trying to manual uh, manually stop. Go ahead and jump into the cross man again. Try to get pressure off the edge. He actually hits the guy across the middle. That's the area of the field I'm supposed to play. Go into cover two, and this seems to be the Achilles heel to this guy. He, he seemed to struggle against cover two. Uh, and right here, the defensive back was in position to make a play for that ball and actually came, came running towards the quarterback. That would have been an interception. Could have potentially been a pick six. So he got bailed out by the CPU in that type of situation because... Fuller played stupid in that particular play, so it drops down into smash and actually does a little um, a little hitch route. That was one of his go-to plays that he actually that he read fairly effectively against the type of coverage. Once again, a crossing route right here. Actually, it's a running back uh, on the backhand side and the flat. So this guy was just dotting me up, uh, going up and down the field, up and down the field. Now he goes into the single back uh, formation. I try to go ahead and hit him with some pressure off the edge. This is out of the 43 over, I believe. So right there, hit the pressure gets picked up, and I've got a defender to actually fall out there. Now he's out of timeouts. He burned his timeouts. I'm going to go into cover two. I've got basically a couple defenders in the area, and I actually get a nice little user lurk right there uh, to go and stop that drive. Um, going up 7-0, uh, I'm punting the ball back to him. So a very tight defensive battle. So right now, go with hard flats. Want to take away uh, those underneath routes. Uh, he actually takes off this quarterback, and look at this dot right here. Actually goes ahead and hits this guy on a comeback route, uh, and he's, he's, he's able to find that guy, find find the hole right there. So I'm going to go back into um, the, the safety blitz there. I've got my hook zone set up. I'm going with cloud flats this time to get, try to take away um, those dual route combinations. And right here, um, Mac is able to go and tackle his, def his uh uh, uh, ma'am uh, but he's able to go ahead and get a first down yardage so um, went ahead and ma made an adjustment right here so he goes right back to that smash concept on the back end side so this guy really ran only a few different plays but he didn't know how to run those plays pretty fairly effectively and right here this is the play of the game right here um, Amos actually top, tap, taps the ball to Jackson uh, and Jackson comes up with it I get an I get an interception so that really put the steam out of his uh, out of his entire uh, play calling right here so you try to do a run run play right there uh, this Defensive back comes off of a block, back into the play action fullback wheel. 
um, looking for the uh, to the crossing route, and there's nobody handy. He tries to manually blitz me, and this is it. This is going to be, be able to put me up by two. Um, David is just chasing me right down here. He tries to go ahead and do the tackle, but um, Gabriel's able to go ahead and get a nice uh, completion for a touchdown. So up by two possessions right now. Three minutes left in the second quarter. He's got plenty of time. This is when this guy started spamming um, the, uh, the, the verticals play against me out of the single back. And he had his reads down. So right here actually finds a seam. And he actually almost comes down with that. That actually was a perfect read. Goes back uh, to verticals once again. Um, I wasn't pressing my guys at all. Um, and I want to go ahead and try to put some quarters uh, seams over there. And look at this. He actually hits a little wheel route perfectly. And uh, it gets another completion. So... Um, I, I went ahead and seamed up my guys and once again. I think I was going into um, like a kind of a cover four type shell. Um, and I actually did, I think, hard, hard flats or cloud flats right there. And he actually makes a good read once again. So this guy definitely had his reads down. He knew his plays. He knew the mechanics of his plays. I jump into a cover two right now. And I want to be, I want to user Floyd. And I've got uh, my defensive uh, defensive line um, on a, a tackle, so I think I get a little block shed right here and actually sack him uh, for um, a, a 11 yard loss. So he goes back to once again the verticals of play one more time, and this actually was messing up his plays, and he threw right into double coverage. Bad decision right there. Amos comes up with another pick in this game. So my defensive backfield was actually just killing it for me right now. So um, I go into a stretch play right now. He's, he's using a lot of aggressive defenses. I want to try to go and seal off that block. And look at this uh, user tackle by him. It just suction tackles me uh, for only a two-yard gainer. Uh, it should have been more than that. Back into the I forge slot, looking for the halfback wheel. Um, and actually, because he's using an aggressive eight man blitz, his guys were getting in. This guy had some blitzes that were blowing up my offensive line, so I'm going to definitely go back to this tape. This play in particular, I don't. This is this is a corner blitz, but his his linebacker gets in and actually sacks me. So uh, I'm gonna have to come back to this. Uh, but at fourth and 16, he really hasn't got any points on the board. I've got to pump the ball to this guy. I can't give him a short field. I got to make him earn it down the field. So right here, I come out of a blitz myself. It actually gets picked up. I didn't get it set up correctly. He almost throws it to Roquan Swift to get another interception right here. So now I go into. I think I'm in. Um, uh, basically a nickel defense and I'm just trying to take away his reads and right there he actually drops a dot right in between my my, uh, my defenders right there they go ahead and a nice little completion back to the same look again but he throws it back into one of my corners right here and Kyle Fuller actually comes up with an interception because of cover two so this guy struggled against cover two and that was actually the difference right there so uh, this is going to be the final play of the game uh, right here I actually hit the crossing route right here and Burton's able to go and get a tackle and I think uh, at the end of the quarter uh, this guy just thinks that he just has no answer to my defense whatsoever. So once again, my subscribers, thank you for your support, guys. I really appreciate it. Um, this uh, and watching my games and uh, gameplays and all your support. And until next time.